Hey guys, so Jane here from Loser Gaming. In this video, I have some information on the six new weapons we're going to be getting in the French DLC for Battlefield 1 called They Shall Not Pass. So we still haven't got a release date for this. It's due to come out in March. And sorry for my voice, I've been feeling quite hoarse lately and I'm kind of losing my voice. But I still want to get this information out to you guys. So if you drop a like down below, I'd really appreciate that. So the first one we're going to be getting is the Ruby Roll 1918. Um, a lot of these names are French names, so sorry if I butcher them a little bit, but this is a French automatic rifle that fires at 600 rounds per minute. The official classification of this weapon is a carbine, but um, it looks somewhat like an SMG, so we're likely going to see it in the assault class. And then the next weapon we have is the RSC 1917 semi-automatic French rifle. Now this one's a no-brainer, it's going to go to the medic class as a semi-automatic rifle. And pretty much all these weapons are French, except for one Swedish shotgun. And uh, that gun is the Jor Jogren Inner Shield. Uh, sorry, hard to pronounce that name, but it's a Swedish shotgun. And only 4,000 of these were ever produced, and they stopped being produced in 1909. The likeliness of seeing this in World War One is extremely unlikely. Um, we wouldn't, you wouldn't really see this be used in actual combat. But uh, for the purposes of this game, they did include it because it seems like they wanted to include one of every weapon and this filled a shotgun roll. Now the next is the Shosho light machine gun. Um, I talked about this a while ago. We already knew this weapon was coming as well as the MLE 1903 Extended, uh, which is the pistol that's coming. Um, the Shosho's light machine gun going to the support class. The MLE is a pistol with a bigger magazine than the current MLE, um, but we're not really sure what class this is going to go to. And then lastly, we have the Level Model 1886 Bolt Action French Rifle, and it's probably pronounced Lebel, um, but this is a Bolt Action Sniper Rifle. It appeared to have iron sights in the images I looked up, and we'll see what kind of images I put up on screen. But uh, yeah, those are pretty much the six weapons we're getting. We're also getting three melee weapons in this DLC, which are the Cogwheel Club, the Nail Knife, and the Trench Floor. So yeah, that's pretty much it for these weapons. I'm probably just going to end the video here because my voice is starting to work up again. But uh, if you guys enjoyed the video, don't forget to drop a like down below and subscribe and tell me what you think about these weapons. But that's what it is for you guys. Thanks for watching. I'll see you guys next time.